What's up guys, Shay Stevens here, PDGA number 77522, and I'm here with the back night of my casual round at Boyer Town Park Disc Golf Course. Let's get to it. Before we get to the video, please click that like button if you're enjoying the content. If you find yourself coming back often, make sure you're subscribed and click that notification bell. It really helps me out and I try to post videos at least once a week. As always, thank you all for the support. So sorry that the conclusion of this round is taking so long to get out. I wanted to get that review of the Axiom Rhythm in and just, you know, this is a crazy time of year. I've actually, I just got back from the shop. I unfortunately got a tire in my nail. I had to get that plugged. So, uh... Life keeps throwing me some fun, you know, first world problems. Uh, but I did finally get this round, uh, the rest of the round, edited together and presented for you. The quick summary is, uh, well, first off, if you haven't watched the front nine, uh, check out Dirt. I will have a, uh, I'll have the link to the front nine for you. Uh, basically, uh, met my buddy Matt on Sunday. We played Kenilworth, and then we drove over to Boyertown because it was 10 minutes away. Uh, so this is actually my third round of the weekend. I am really high in the pitch count, so uh, I'm just going to apologize now. I'm doing my best, but I am gassed, especially coming to the back nine. Uh, but still, it's a really fun course. Very short, technical, all, all par threes, but you got to work for them birdies. So uh, if you're in the area, definitely worth checking out. But uh, without further ado, let's get to the back nine. All right, hole 10, 214. Definitely a hyzer shot. You got to go through, pick a gap, go through it. I'm going to be going. Clips entropy. So if you just push straight, but still get some face in. Fade. I'm looking for that fade eventually. It didn't fade. <laughs> Good snappage. Beat it. The keys. Alright. Hole 11, 325. This hole took my lunch money the last time I played it. But I think I can get something there. <clears throat> there you go, rhythm. That's a little bit of a turnover. Oh, I yanked that one over. Come back, come back, come back. Trying to kill that. Smooth, you're hanging out with me. Yeah. Right on the edge. Layups. Oh, dude, grab your justice. Safe. It is safe. So I will take it. But you're right. I could have <laughs> oh boy. 
When you're ready. Ooh, straight through the inside, yep. All right, I'm up there. Yeah. All right, it's 218 up there into the left. Good effort. Two seventeen, straight shot. Well, apparently the uh, the electronic should be able to go pretty straight. Nice shot. That's the shot. That's the park shot. It was an ace run, but. Ooh, just short. Hole 14, 230 or 229 downhill. Easy feed up envy, just so I know it doesn't go in that OB crick on the left. Actually, I like the shape of this right there. Getting it up, forehand entropy. Hopefully, get a little flex out of this boy. Too much flex. Hit something. On the edgy. Hit a tree or something. Maybe that one. Inside it. Oh. Still up. Go. Get up. Tapping out. Yeah. Hole 15, 265 uphill. Dang, this requires a straight shot. I'm going to try that reactor again. Eclipse. Do to, do to not hit a tree this time, I swear. Pin high, but up left. Right. That's an inertia doing inertia things. Do a rip, hang out with me, probably. Yep. Just enough of a frond in the way to make it interesting. Everything is killing me. 
Hole 16 to 28, par three. Guarded by a lot of trees here. Forehand looks kind of cool, but I'm just going with a backhand. Kind of push that right inside gap and hopefully the uh, electric entry will hook up nicely. Hole 17, 326, uphill dead straight. I'm gonna try and just rope a photon at it. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Doesn't have a distance. Oh, in the tweet. Oh, yep. <sighs> Barring Matt Sly. Come and get it, hole 17. And this would make me really feel good. Especially if I get like, not go away. Yes! Found my foot again! Gotta get this finger under the disc! Okay! Alright, hole 18, par 3, 365 feet, slightly downhill. So, I think it's the longest hole we just we put on the course. Uh, this is gonna be just a full send photon. Have some fun. Hopefully, I don't. Go back. Actually, switch it up. We're going full send. I need to get the big boy out. Red fishing photon, gummy with the dome, so he's got that glide. Oh, if you threw it in the air, it was going to be amazing. Uh, nice kick. Towards the basket, at least. Yeah. Right. He ascend. We're at the Valk. That was the, the Valkyrie. Valkyrie. I say ascends, I ascends do not hyzer. Floaty boy in. Put the brakes on that side. Oh, yeah. Yeah, good point. Oh. Right, over the basket. Oh, 
Sit. There you go. And that'll wrap up this casual round at Booyer Town Park Disc Golf Course. Again, great, great disc golf weekend. Uh, good Sunday with my buddy, two rounds, and uh, you know a lot of shots the day before at Thompson. So the next day I was really sore, uh, but it was that good sore, you know that you know you put the work in sore. So uh, I haven't played that much that much disc golf in a long time, and it felt good. But uh, again, this round wasn't my best. I was definitely you know fe feeling the fatigue. I didn't bring enough food, unfortunately. Um, like that double bogey on 11, that one stung you. Just two putts I didn't focus on and whiffed. And then uh, that last putt you saw, I just kind of like just, you know, arm just drifted to the right and missed chain out. So, uh, you know, on the plus side, I got a new high score to beat at uh, Boyer Town. I definitely can beat that. So next time I'm in the area, hoping to uh, do a little bit better. Hopefully I'll have my camera on me. You guys can come along for that ride. Uh, if you're in the area, definitely check out Boyer Town. It, it is a great technical course. It pretty much throws every line uh, you could imagine at you and really demands accuracy and consistency. So, uh Definitely check it out if you're in the area. Uh, also, while I was film or uh, editing this video together, uh, last night actually my buddy texted me and congratulated me on hitting 800 subscribers on YouTube, which is funny because YouTube didn't send me any notifications uh, you know, through email that I got new subs, but I, when I opened the panel, I saw, yes, I picked up new subscribers and hit 800. So thank you guys for all the support. As promised, we are going to be doing a giveaway to commemorate that milestone. <clears throat> I will have that uh, giveaway video uh, put together as soon as I can if life will stop throwing me curveballs. Uh, I've already teased the first two discs I'm giving away. Uh, the last one's going to be this Jomez Pro Stamped Neutron Volt 174 grams, so real pretty gold stamp. Uh, this will be part of the three disc giveaway. Uh, so be sure to keep an eye out on my channel for uh, the announcement for this uh, for the giveaway. Uh, you'll get the conditions you need to meet to be eligible. And then I'll probably be drawing a winner about a week after I launch that video. So uh, stay tuned for that. Uh, guys, as always, thank you for all the support. If you have any questions for me, reach out. I'll do my best to answer them. Take care. Thank you to my sponsors. For all your disc golf needs, check out Phoenix Discs and Basket Bashers Disc Golf.